a member of um, the parole board of Pennsylvania, Philadelphia, I think. Let's call them. Demand the release. Okay. Please hold on while I try that extension. You know what? I'm just gonna call back because you're just gonna <laughs> take all my phone credit and I don't have anything to call with anymore. I'm calling f from far away, the other side of the Atlantic Ocean. Supporting our brothers and sisters, the Move Nine, members of the Move family, founded by none other than John Africa. For those who, for those who don't know, Move is a revolutionary family, a group, an organization of people living together, working together leading a natural life, a healthy life, strong life, full of righteousness, compassion, getting away from the system and the system's uh, harms like pollution, injustice, corruption, prostitution, everything. Anything that pollutes kills life, destroys life. <clears throat> the Move Nine are nine Move members who have been unjustly imprisoned since August 8th of 1978 for a crime that they have not committed when hundreds of cops raided their house and <clears throat> One of the cops was dead. Ballistics and everything shows that the cop, that it was impossible for the cop to have been shot by the move people who were in the house. Twelve more people. Okay. And, uh, but still, they f framed them and they said they shot, they shot the cop. They wrote it on, in the newspaper even before that there was a trial or anything they shot a cop the thing is the system was very and is very much threatened by MOVE and by the position that MOVE takes because MOVE teaches people how to be independent of the system and those running the system want people to be dependent of the system in any kind of way medically, psychologically, health-wise, educationally, professionally, everything, everything, every aspect of life, they want people to be slaves of the system. And uh, MOVE was not doing that, and MOVE was showing people how to get out of that trap. So, since 1978, Nine move members have been jailed. <clears throat> there were twelve people in that house. Three were freed because they were granted a deal. If you if you can claim today that you are not a move member, they s you know you'll be set free. So three of those move members said they're just supporters. They're not move members. They feared for their lives. They didn't want to go to jail. You know, you can't blame them. They were freed. The nine others have come to be known as the Move Nine, who are sitting in jail. Two of which have already died in jail. Mysteriously. And we all know what that means. And they want to kill our Move people in jail and we are doing everything we can to not let that happen 
just by using our voice, our determination, you know, our energy. That's all we have. But if we use it efficiently, it's more than enough. Let's try calling these bastards once again. <coughs> Yes, hello. Hello. Hi. How may I help you? Yes. I think you know why we're calling. We're calling for the release of Edward Goodman Africa. Uh, Do you have a, um, yes. Your name, sir? Yes, my name is Omar Shekli. I am from Morocco. I'm calling from Morocco. And we're talking about Edward Goodman Africa. Uh, AM. Your relationship with him? Well, I'm a MOVE supporter from Morocco, and I've been in touch with MOVE. For, for like 11 years already and uh, I know those people very closely they're very good people they're very honest people they haven't done his anything name, wrong they haven't done anything name, wrong please. sorry his name please I just have to log the phone call yes yes sure oh his name is Edward Goodman Africa AM slash or dash sorry dash 4974 that's his prison uh, AM you know, prison number Yes, correct. Okay. And so, um, if I just can say this, is that, uh, you know, MOVE people, the MOVE 9 have been innocent, and the government officials know this, and, and it's really a shame that they're still in jail, and, you know, nobody's doing anything about it. These people have done absolutely nothing wrong, and, uh, you know, it's just... It's just unacceptable, you know, for them to be sitting in jail while they can be sitting at home with their family and their loved ones, you know. Please do the right thing. Please do what you can to release them. I mean, you know, we... I will make the phone call, sir. Thank you for calling. All right. Well, I still didn't finish, but I had more to say. Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. Sorry. Yeah. Go ahead. All I wanted to say is that I don't know... I don't know you personally, and I don't know, you know, to what extent you have, you know, something, you know, uh, a possibility in all this, but all I want to say is that I really hope that you guys do the right thing, because at the end of the day, you know, the most important thing in life is our well-being, is our peace of mind, is our happiness, our health. It's not the money, it's not the status, it's not all that stuff, you know, I really hope that this message really, you know, um, you know, uh, I mean, re reaches, reaches, you know, you know, to your heart, you know, to other people's heart, you know, who are there, you know, to the parole board, because seriously, this is, this is unjust, this is really, and all I want to say is that, you know, the, the international community is watching you guys, and it's not in the favor of the United States. You know, to be treating your enemies like this because we are, you know, fully aware of what's happening and we're not going to stay quiet. We are going to keep exposing these things until you guys stop it because this is, you know, it's been 40 years already. The, the Move 9 have been in jail and, and they're only one of the examples. I mean, there are, you know, um, thousands more, you know, thousands more examples in, in, in the United States who should not be in jail. And I mean, you know, these are fellow human beings, okay? You know, I mean, you know, this has nothing to do with being American or Moroccan or whatever. We're all human beings. We all need our freedom and, and justice. So please, please do everything you can, you know, to do what's right. Please, I beg you. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Have a good day, sir. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Thank you. All right. <laughs> I'm not used to talking to the phone. <laughs> I'm not used to talking to these people. I don't know how to talk to them, really. But I did what I can. Let's see what it does. Yeah. On a move. Long live John Africa. Free the move nine. Free Mumia Abu Jamal. Free all life. <laughs>